another wonderful day here. No progress on the logs yet today, but after the workout, I'm gonna be doing some some moving of heavy objects. Um, didn't want to do it before because I figured that would probably destroy any chances of a solid bench press workout, and it would knock my body weight down every time I do like outdoor labor when it's 80, 90 degrees lose some body weight and we're trying to push the numbers upwards so for the sake of the way and then a good workout yeah i'm not going to do that yet we'll do that after oh got a door coming in here that's all right all right time to check the weight drank a good amount of water today so i don't know we'll see hope for the best right prepare for the worst zero it out Cal. Six point oh. All right, I'll take it. Zero it out. Always gotta double check. Otherwise, it's not real. One ninety six point oh. So one ninety six point oh, slow and steady. I'm excited about that. It's about those micro gains, those small jumps that add up over time to big progress. You know, it's not two hundred yet, but. Now I'm only four pounds away, whereas back at the beginning of this journey, I forget, I was like 191 or something like that. So five pounds up from then, workouts are going well, food's good. So the progress is steady, which is what I'm looking for. I'll take steady incremental progress any day over random big jumps and big drops. Um, you know, it goes up and down a little bit, but in general, it's, it's going up. So yeah, it's exciting. Um, all right, so let's get into the uh, chest workout for the day. Also, once I write down my workout plan, I always um, put it up on the wall just so I'm kind of focusing on it while I'm doing the workout. I've found that for myself, the workouts are much more effective um, just because I'm seeing it throughout the routine. So it just makes it more likely that I'm going to do all the sets and reps. Having it on the phone is good too. Um, you know, and workout plan is definitely 100% necessary if you want good results. You don't want to be going to the gym and just kind of like, well, maybe I'll do this, maybe I'll do that, maybe I'll do this. You're always going to end up doing more if you plan it out. You're always going to end up doing more and you're going to do it more successfully. Sketchy at best. So got nine last Friday with these. Um, hoping to beat that by one or a couple if they feel easy. We'll see. We got no rush. It's the long game. All right. Let's look at my room here. Like my build of dumbbells. <laughs> they work. Always pause reps. <laughs>
can't get another rep, or you don't think you're gonna be able to, get a really slow eccentric. <laughs> Gotta document the second set, because sometimes, just like on a dumbbell shoulder press, second set feels a little easier. We'll see. If I can get even eight solid, I'd be happy, but maybe we'll push for that 10. So workout is actually complete. I'm not gonna do the tricep stuff today because tomorrow is gonna to be a longer than normal workout because as I mentioned yesterday's video, tomorrow we're going to baby shower. Well, I'm not going, um, but my wife and son are going to the baby shower. I was not invited and that's okay. Um, so I'm going to work out instead. And normally my workouts take 45 minutes to an hour. Baby shower is probably gonna be longer than that, so I figure I'll probably have some time to do some arm specific stuff. Not sure if I'll document that or not. Depends on what the uh, public gym space looks like. I usually film, obviously, on my own, so that's what I'm used to, but I'll still probably try and grab some clips of the uh, heavy stuff. Anyway, that's it for the uh, workout. Stay focused out there, crush those workouts, stay on your plan, stay on your uh, diet plan, whether it be maintaining or leaning out or, or bulking, you know, just keep the focus. Remember sometimes, Things can stall for a little while and your body is just getting ready to make that next jump in progress um, in the direction that you're trying to go. So sometimes you just got to stick it out. Um, keep your uh, nose to the grindstone. I think that's the term. You know, you, you get what I'm saying though. You got to keep the focus and, and stay strong and keep putting in the work and in time you'll get there. All right, that's it. Enjoy the weekend.